If you all are a victim of traumatization, I will tell you this, that I can relate to that trauma. If you've ever had any kind of thoughts that prevent you or provoke you from doing things, I will tell you that there is a way to convert those thoughts. Okay, number one, never be shy to correct yourself. That is number one. Always have confidence to correct yourself. When it comes to any kind of trauma, if you've been a victim in any kind of way of traumatization and it comes upon your mind, okay, there's something that did not give you the closure that you needed. But we're telling you now that you have purpose and you have potential. And that closure that you needed, let me know in the comments, what kind of closure did you need from your situation and let's see how we can help you cope with that that closure that you've needed I suffer with permanent injuries from my traumatization and from my in the incidents that I went through and I will tell you this that it's a daily reminder Every day I wake up, I'm like, whoa, why is there an indention and break in my skull? You know, why is there a, a wound on my knee from when I was 15 years old? You know, I mean, it all adds up to the daily reminders of the permanent damages that that traumatization had left me. But I'm telling you now that there is hope for you. There is a chance for you. If you believe in your potential, you can and you will become successful. But do not doubt yourself because the moment that you doubt yourself is the moment to where you fall off of the edge. If you have been a victim of traumatization and those traumatizing thoughts go into your mind at times to remind you of it in ways that prevents you or provokes you, I am telling you now, or even makes you discomforted, I'm telling you now that you can convert those thoughts and you have purpose and potential. In an example of doctrine perspective, if there's inappropriate things that discomfort you, thoughts that go through your mind that's not very appropriate. So that may discomfort you or prevent you or even provoke you. So how to convert those thoughts is to think a doctrine perspective. When you think like a doctor, you're thinking more medical fields. You're thinking, I need to go walking to get my hormones so I can build muscle. Not because of anything inappropriate, but because I love myself to build my muscles. And because in doctrine perspective, muscles are very healthy to have. And in fact, when you have a lot of muscles, that reduces your risk of things like diabetes and other kinds of cancerous stuff. So we want to let you all know that you have a purpose, you have potential. And if you have trauma, I can relate to that and understand it from someone who can relate to the understanding. Now, no one is exact. Nobody goes through the exact same thing. So I'm not saying that we may have went through the exact same thing, but thank goodness for that, okay? But it's the fact that you have a chance to recover and it starts with you. It starts with focusing on your thoughts and how to better your thoughts. Stay healthy, invest wisely, always know that you have potential.